This is my, my review on Tim Allen film called Buzz Lightyear Stockman. Now this is a spin-off that's set in the Toy Story universe. That's all taking place on a VHS. While the Toy Stories are watching it. Toys. Yeah. And that's the main premise. And um that's the um what the whole film is of I'm guessing uh when the series came out, I'm guessing the Buzz Lightyear Stack I mean, took place on TV while the Toy Story was watching, you know, when it was never been, can't confirm one, how, like, the movie was. A anyway, I'm, see, I'm dragging around and getting this off in a little bit. So, Buzz Lightyear Sound Command is, uh, about Buzz Lightyear, honestly, played by, once again, by Tim Allen. This is a really good Tim Allen film, actually. Lots of fun to watch. So, they're on saying, sending, uh, they're looking for these green Martians. They find uh, some on different green Martians. And the, and, uh, Buzzley has a hunch that it's all Zerg behind it, and he ends up being right. Him and his partner, Ward, I think. Ward it is called. Um, uh, he's kind of a dick. Be honest with you, but he, he's also very likable. However, um, he sadly dies. Only way to bring him back, but in villain form. And he's been working with Slurk since the Academy. So, he's been a bad guy for me out the entire film. Okay. Uh, and, uh, Buzz Lightyear, after war dying, supposedly dead, um, he's been so shut, he shut himself out because he didn't want to pot, pot it because he didn't want to go through that again, only to be later to be outsmarted and outwhipped and outnumbered that he calls for help, calls for backup. For all the three people that wanted to help him. Booster. And. XI and. I forget what the girl's name. I think her name's R Ranger Nova. I believe. Uh, that's her. Document name. And uh. And um. So. Uh, this is when Darkman has been taking brainwashed by, be completely brainwashed by the human with the touch of evil by the powers of Zerg. So Buzz Lightyear like, reverses by being sent into the human mind and reverses with the power of good and it saves the world with his team. Zerd gets bringing into custody along with the traitor of the star command and that's and they'll get promoted. Uh being they'll get promoted and uh Booster gets his dream of becoming a um Light Ranger, I mean, uh, Stockman Ranger, and he decided he, he said, he decided to say to his captain he was wrong, he needed backup, and he's kind of asked, okay, so who's your partner going to be? <laughs> and he says, I made my choice, don't worry, captain. <laughs> so he chose all three of them. <laughs> <laughs> and they go off on making adventures in the TV series Buzz Lightyear of Stockman. So, so the movie is pretty good. I think it's as good as the TV series. I mean, the TV series came out second, but I think the TV series is that's that good. I really thought the character development in Buzz Lightyear was really good, and the action was fun to watch. And the comic was well funny when it, when the film needs to be have a sense of humor because it 
had a good sense of humor on, and um, <laughs> on the whole premise. I so I like to uh, so I like that didn't took itself incredibly seriously, but it was uh uh. Pretty much when we see Budge like you out of me ready to be executed and he's saying to his team that he was wrong, he needs the help and code. So it's and I was really uh, I really like that part. Because that's what brought them all back to come and they didn't have to help him and they brought the call team together. So I gave this, I'm um, giving this a 10 out of 10.